हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज विपिन कुमार एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल विपिन के टेक टिप्स इन टूडेज वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन अबाउट गूगल क्लासरूम ट्यूटोरियल हाउ टू सेट अप अ गूगल क्लासरूम एंड हाउ टू यूज इट एज अ टीचर एंड एज अ स्टूडेंट ओके सो लेट स्टार्ट सो इफ यू ऑलरेडी हैव अ गूगल अकाउंट दैन देर इज नो प्रॉब्लम यू जस्ट क्लिक ऑन योर गूगल अकाउंट एंड क्लिक ऑन दिस हेयर यू विल सी that google classroom is there click on that then it will take you to the google classroom yes so now we are in google classroom and in this these are my classes which i have already set up and if you are new then what you have to do uh, you have to click on this plus sign and there are two options so join classes for students create classes for teachers so if i am a teacher i'll click on it it will ask me uh, to continue then i can give class name here let's say my class name is a uh, where the section is b subject uh, i can give subject name also let's say i teach dance so and room number and click on create so when you click on create it will uh, make a classroom for you which you can access and use the functions which are useful to us we'll see in few seconds just uh, waiting for this yeah so now our class is ready where uh, we are in uh, class a of section uh, we are in section b of class a okay so you can see here uh, the first thing which you see is stream then class work then people and grades so we'll discuss all of these one by one so, but before uh, that if you look at this and uh, there is a class code given here just click on display you will get this if you want to invite your students and teachers so you can copy it and you can send it to your students through whatsapp or through their email ids okay so this is one then uh, in this option if let's say you want to make this a really good so you have to choose a theme let's say i like this theme so select class theme now it has changed to a new theme and if i want to upload a photo that also i can do otherwise next thing which is important is to explore this stream basically it is a tool to communicate with your class as a teacher so if you put something here so your students which are added to this class will be able to see your posts and they can respond and they can ask questions also so this is we can do with stream function then next is class work so when we come to this class work so you will see three options here create google calendar and class drive folder so google calendar and class drive folder are basically tools where uh, google calendar is used to create the classes so let's say you want to take class tomorrow so then click on it and schedule a class add the title of the class then you can change the date and time using this and you can add guests also if let's say they are not added to your classroom then you can add them also and next is which is important is at google meet video conferencing so through this what will happen uh, it will create a link for uh, your class which can be used by your attendees by your students so you can uh, they can copy it and they can join if they don't have the link and add the location if you want otherwise leave it as it is it is up to you a description or attachment if let's say you want to give some notes your, to your students to uh, read uh, them in advance so that can be put here otherwise save okay so here you can see this is the class which have been uh, which has saved here so this is the use of calendar now in class class drive folder you can save all the data related to your class in this folder uh, where uh, you can save your notes you can save uh, the list of 
your textbooks or the reference books anything you can say whatever data is related to your class can be saved in google drive and that link can be shared with the students they can access it next is this create so when you click on create so it will take you to this menu here you can see so many options are there so for example if you want to give assignment to your class you have to click on it otherwise quiz assignment can be given by this option questions if let's say i click on this so i can frame the questions i can put the instructions and i can add a document here through these these options google drive or the link or any file is there or if let's say i want to um, give a video link to my students to refer that also can be done using this option otherwise click on create and then you have these much options where you can create a document slide sheets drawing forms whatever is required as per the demand okay so this is the option uh, in uh, the questions here if you go there uh, here you can see that this is for a class a of section b all the students if let's say you don't want to give questions to all the students so you can uncheck all and just select the selected students then points due date so these options are there accordingly you can check them okay similar thing can be done for assignment also for uh, let's say now you don't want to give anything but you just want to create a material so what you can do just let's say you want to create module 1 so write module 1 keep the instructions in this any description if you want to give and then create let's say you want to create a document so it will create a google doc for you which can be edited here which can be edited as you can see here okay and you can share using this option so you can share with your students okay but for that you need to add the students here you can see there are two uh, person available for it so i can share with them otherwise uh, just leave it and uh, again go back to this so this is module one generated it is just a draft because i have not shared it with anyone next is people so in people section uh, you can add teachers if they are teaching with you and if they are teaching the same subject so you can add them using this just put their email id and add them otherwise leave it if you are a single teacher and this section is for the students either by sharing this link or by typing their names you can invite them so it will be convenient if you copy this link and share with the students on whatsapp so then uh, so that they can click on this link and directly join your class it will save your time now next is grades but grades will only be activated uh, when you give some assignment or class test or quiz anything then only grades uh, will show you something here otherwise nothing is there so if you evaluate something then only this option is useful okay so these are the four options if you go to settings here you can change the settings of the classes okay you can manage invite codes enable disable or reset or class view in class view if you want to uh, check this this is the display code there is a class code which can be displayed then stream who can post on the stream a student can post and comment or only teacher can post and comment that accordingly you can change class work on the stream also can be given then grading calculation so for grading calculation what you can do you can check their total points or you can create a category where uh, some algorithm which can be used to calculate the marks if it is a relative grading so 
if and in that also option is there if you want your students to check uh, the grades they can check if you click on this otherwise they will not be able to check okay and grade categories you can be uh, added using this option add grade category uh, you can give a name to it and then you can add it by clicking on this otherwise you can go back just discard it yeah so i hope you understood the things in a better way now this is for the class which we have currently generated but before that if you look on this here you can see under this teaching section you can see one two three four four classes are there three i have already created this is the fourth one and you can review them let's say i want to go to this so i can check the activities here so it was created on 26th april and this is only one document avail available okay so if i click on people you can see that there are two uh, one student and one teacher so like that class under class work also we can check whatever we gave so i gave one top uh, assignment named vibration so that is visible here so like that we can check and grades also i can check uh, so that is the uh, single students that's why this is the class average also so that's it okay thank you if you like this content if you like the video if you got something useful from this video then please share it with other people so